Hello everyone and welcome to Songs of One Breath. So I took my theme for today thinking about the equinox. You know, here in Britain it's the spring equinox in the northern hemisphere. But wherever you are, it's this time of balance between the dark and the light, the day and the night, the same length. And it made me think about how can we find the place of balance within us. Because there's so much happening in the world around us which can knock us off balance. There's so much um, confusion and fear and difficulty around. So what are the practices that can help us to find a strong and balanced place inside where we're less affected by all of the turmoil around us, a place that we can call upon and return to when we need it. So of course, in a very real sense, that that's all of the practice that we do. That's what it's about. That's what it's for. But um, I began today with this practice of peace. Om Shanti, Om Shanti, Om Shanti. One of the realities is that whatever we're calling on, apparently outside us, our desire for more peace, the very act of calling upon it can help us to find it already there inside us. So let's take a few moments to breathe with Om Shanti, calling on peace, breathing in peace. And at the bottom of the in-breath, finding that ground of peace inside us to breathe out from so that we can send a breath of peace out into the world as well, so that our very presence brings more peace into wherever we are, whatever situation we find ourselves in. Breathing in, Om Shanti, calling on peace. Breathing out, Om Shanti. Making our very selves a gift of peace. To this moment. And there's a mantra of calm, of peace in the Upanishads that repeats this being is truth, this being is love, this being is peace. I am Atma Satya, I am Atma Bhakti. I am Atma Shanti. Our true nature is all of these things. And of course we forget. But we can choose to consciously breathe with these qualities and remember our nature as love, as truth, as peace. I am Atma Satyam. This being is truth. The truth of this being is 
Bhakti, I am Atma Bhakti. This being is love. I am Atma Shanti. This being is peace. Shanti Om Siddhi. Peace Om. So may it be. Tat Tvam Asi. Thou art that. The truth of this being is love, is peace, is beauty. Shanti Om Siddhi. And our deepest desire, the thing we long for most, which might sometimes be peace, we already have within us. And often it's just a case of remembering, of finding a way to access it. And the breath is so often a key to that. So I invite you to experiment with a breath of peace, breathing in peace and then breathing it out just at the moment when you feel you need it most. So I've also been spending time with the Heart of Perfect Wisdom Sutra, the Heart Sutra, recently. And this partly speaks about the great illusion of reality. And it's so easy to be caught up in this illusion of form and to feel that that is the ultimate reality because it's so present for us in this, <clears throat> this way of life, this form, this plane of life. And the Heart Sutra says to us, O oh, Shariputra, form is void and void is form. Not separate from form is void. Not separate from void is form. What is form? That is void. What is void? That is form. Like this, 
our feelings, thoughts, impressions, consciousness. Here, O Shariputra, all phenomena are marked with emptiness and not created, not destroyed, not impure, not pure, not deficient, not complete. O Shariputra, therefore, in the void is no form and no feeling, thought, impression, consciousness, and so on. Not, not, not. None, nothing exists. Really, this is like the Sufis who say, nothing exists except the one reality. When we say no to all of these forms, all of these structures, what are we saying yes to? That's the interesting thing. And the Heart Sutra finishes by going beyond all of this, going beyond, going beyond the beyond, we arrive at the true reality, the Buddha nature, the one reality. Gate, gate, paragate, parasamgate, bodhi, soha. going beyond all of our thoughts, all of our preconceptions, towards, towards this freedom from illusion, this openness to the ultimate truth, ultimate reality, enlightenment, the light of our being, Bodhi, Soha. Is emptiness and emptiness is form. 
and we breathe into that as we breathe into the depth of the form of our being. Let's breathe into the emptiness inside. And we can feel this as a deep spaciousness in our being. And we can feel it as the space inside every cell, the space inside every atom. And we know from physics today that this is true. Form is emptiness. Emptiness is form. Breathing in, breathing into the spaciousness within the form of this being. Maybe we can breathe in a little more space into the way life is playing out for us right now. A little bit more spaciousness into our thought forms, our ways of approaching our life. And sometimes it's enough just to remember to take a breath when things become tense and fraught and tight and hectic. Just one conscious breath of spaciousness. Breathing into this void of our being. Breathing into our true nature of light, beauty and peace. And consciously calling on that. So what happens if we're just aware of our normal natural breath? No need to make it anything special. Just aware of it coming in and being aware of it going out. Breath in, breath out. Just centering in this natural breath. Now let's breathe a long breath in, noticing what it feels like to breathe a long breath. A long breath in and a long breath out. Just being aware that the breath is long as it comes in and long as it goes out. Long breath in and long breath out. And now let's breathe a short breath in and a short breath out. Just being aware of a short breath. Short breath in, short breath out. Being aware that the breath is short as it comes in and short as it goes out. And now breathing in a heavy, coarse breath in. And a heavy, coarse breath out. 
Just being aware that the breath is heavy and coarse as it comes in and heavy and coarse as it goes out. And now breathing a refined breath. Just aware that as the breath comes in, it's refined and as it goes out, it's refined. A refined breath in and a refined breath out. And now with this refined breath, breathing in all of the love that you can breathe in and breathing out all of the love that you can breathe out. Just aware that this refined breath, breathing in love, breathing out love. All of the love you're capable of breathing it in and breathing it out. And now refining the breath even more, breathing in all of the joy that you're capable of breathing, breathing out all of the joy that you're able to. Aware of this refined breath, breathing in joy, breathing out joy. And now, even more refined, breathing in peace, all of the peace that you can breathe in. And breathing out all of the peace you can breathe out, aware of this refined breath, breathing in peace and breathing out peace. Allowing your body this formless form, this form filled with emptiness, allowing it to be full of peace. And as you breathe out peace, filling the room that you are in with peace. And on the next out breath, Filling the building you're in with peace. Breathing in peace. And breathing it out to your whole neighborhood. Sending this refined breath of peace to touch everyone and everything in your whole neighborhood with peace. And now we could imagine the breath of each one of us who's on this call or listening, uniting in a breath of peace, surrounding our whole beautiful planet with this breath of peace. Rivers of peace flowing on the breath from each one of us, coming together, bathing the whole planet in a breath of peace. And each one of us breathing in peace, our inner world bathed in peace with this breath of peace.
and allowing yourself to notice the effect of this breath of peace on every cell of your being in all of the spaces in all of the atoms in all of the cells in all of the organs of this body this formless form filled with emptiness and space filled with peace and the out breath Sending peace to all of our families, all of our friends, all of our neighbours, all beings, human and otherwise, animals, birds, trees, plants, all of our beautiful planet bathed in peace and you can either sing with me or you can just continue to breathe this breath of peace